The acting president, Professor Yomi Oshibaj, visited Delta State in February this year to engage leaders of the Niger Delta on how to spur growth in the region. That meeting led to a promise to the youths that they will meet again to get them more involved in governance. There is no way that any gathering of elders can tell what the future will hold without consulting and conferring with the young people. And that's why I'm going to ensure that I have that meeting with all of the young people, all of the various groups of youth, so that we can talk about the issues and resolve all of the issues. It's been five months since that promise was made and the youths are still holding him to his words. They renewed the call as an official handover of the new National Executive of the Ijo Youth Council in Wari South Local Government Area of Delta State. For them to be sincere, so far so good, so many blueprints, so many issues have been submitted before them. We want to see the government pick up one and then we will be convinced that, okay, even if we are to meet again with the Vice President, will it be another jamboree? The new IYC president says complete resource control will be a major item on the agenda when the acting president fulfills his meets the youth tour as promised. It is now a generally accepted concept that there must be restructuring of Nigeria. And of course, we cannot restructure Nigeria without people coming together. And that is where I want to provide leadership. I will go around the no country of this country to meet other ethnic nationality youth leaders on the green for youths of this country to support restructuring. Because restructuring is in the best interest of this country. I do hope that the vice president is only being held by, by uh, bureaucratic uh, challenges. Uh, we hope that he will call that meeting soon and the youth of the Niger Delta will have the opportunity of presenting our own case to him. The youths believe it's time to actively engage the government with strategizing on how to ensure sustainable peace for optimal growth.